Alright, let's just go. Undead Pirates. Today marks the beginning of an epic battle between undead pirates and the Elder Chaos Druids, conveniently localized entirely within the Chaos Temple between level 9 and 14 Wilderness. Again, this is a huge thing. Very low level Wilderness. And they're itching to get their bony hands on some Wilderness booty. I'm itching to get my hands on some booty as well, honestly. The goal here is to breathe a little life into low-level wilderness in the hope that specialized PvP builds like Pure and Zerks will carve out a space of their own. This is good. To up the ante, we've slipped the Elder Chaos Druids some forbidden knowledge and they're now capable of teleblocking. This is good. Pirates also have an uncommon chance to drop Adamant Seeds or the Teleport Anchoring Scroll. This will actually be very nice, both of which are tradable. Adamant seeds work exactly like mithril seeds, except they'll move you to the east when planting, as opposed to west. And as you're living, laughing, and looting, you might come across a zombie pirate key or two. Okay. These tradable keys are used to open a chest in the pirate's ground ship, located in a single-way combat zone on the eastern shore. Opening the chest acts like a roll on the pirate's loot table, but will double any loot received. Wilderness Agility Course Changes. Now this, I need everyone to actually take this in and inhale the numbers, okay? Because I believe this is actually insane GP per hour for an agility course. Today's update. As an opt-in loot system in the Wilderness Agility Course, you'll notice a shiny new dispenser at the entrance of the course for an upfront fee of 150 K. That's quite expensive when it comes to RuneScape things. They're normally like, oh no, people can't make 20k, let's put the coffer to tank. Shut the fuck up, manked man. You know? Um, so, this is good. I like this. You'll start gaining loot every completed lap. Simply touch the pillar at the end of the course and you'll receive loot and an energy top up. If only gyms worked like that in real life. Um, for the first 1 to 15 laps, you get an average of 10k per lap. That's not bad. 16 to 30 laps, you get an average of 20k per lap. 31 to 60 laps, you get an average of 30k per lap. And then 61 plus laps, you get an average of 40k per lap. Getting 40k every lap of the Wildy Agility course, unless they've updated it and made it longer, that's really, really a lot of money. Um, Superior Slayer Monsters now have a 10% increased chance to spawn during Wilderness Slayer tasks. 10% increased chance. This is good. I like this. Buff. Players can now purchase imbued god capes from Purdue for 250k. I like this. This is good. They're actually doing good updates. Imp boxes can no longer be used in PvP worlds. That should have been done about 8 years ago. But this is good. Um, additionally, manually uncharging your imbue items will refund 100% of the points of seal up from 80%. That's good. Dying with an imbued, I dying with an imbued item such as a berserkering eye, a salve eye, or a slayer helmet eye that is lost on death will now refund either the points or the imbued scroll used to create it. This is good. Good updates. Eight years too late. But good update. I feel like we're getting somewhere, you know? This is good. This is good. Okay, we're going we're gonna to group up. I like the man's name, Toe Sniffer. Make sure you're in the friends chat as well. Friends chat, Dino Space XX. Uh, we're going to fall in. All right, we're going to fall in at the at signs. I need to see it. Bro, this looks beautiful. This looks... We have an army. I like this. This looks absolutely beautiful. This is the mission brief, okay? PVMers are going to be located here. So, we have a squad of absolute giga chads with large penises up here and they will come running in from the north and then we'll also have a squad of absolute giga chads with a little bit smaller penises standing down here and they will come running in from the south 
and the PVMs will be TB'd here, and then the Dark Bows are gonna fly, and everyone dies. Okay, that is the plan. Let's 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 go 514. You know, this this is gonna be the messiest thing in the world, just so we're aware. But you know, do you need a world scout? Yeah, by all means, scout some juicy worlds if possible. We're looking for mains, obviously mainly. Okay, we're here. Oh, we're running in. Okay, we're running in. Fuck it. We just just run in, run in straight away. There's a one two six here. Guess what? There's no longer a one two six here. Kill his dumbass boys. Fantastic. What else have we got? We got a naked guy. He's in the bin. We got a one two two at the older. They're all dead. Mission success, beautiful. Back to the spot. Get your prayer, and then we we just do that, you know. Do it nice and slow, though. Don't jump worlds, you know. We'll go nice and slow and controlled. But that is the that is the plan. That is the plan. We get we get back on the back on the square, boys. Ah, they're going in. Okay, fuck it. Go in. Screw it. Go 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 go. There's a 78 that I can't attack. There is a one two three. He's in the bin. Dark bows fly. Oh my god, what was that XP drop we just got? Wait, I'm not in the friends chat. The friend chat just bugged. Okay, so be careful about that. Bro, we just we just sent that guy to Narnia. Pray at the altar and back we go. Alright. DD or die. That is what we want to see, Springy. Alright, DD or die. We keep a tight ship here. Everyone get back at Bro. Bro man, we've got some boys down south as well. Everyone's gonna get loot today. Okay, so don't be don't be greedy with it. Be patient, be nice, be respectful, and come and get some loot. We now go running in. I'll always try and wait a little bit before running in. There is a 126. I no longer have a spec, sadly. The 126, however, is dead. There's also a one. Bro, there's so many mains here, man. This is fantastic. What else have we got? This guy is not in the friends chat. He's in the friends chat now. Are they all dead? They're all dead. Okay. And we'll go. Again, I don't mind not being the first one in at all times. But give it give it a little bit. So there's skulls. Oh, he's skulled. Smites up, chat. Smites up as well. Poor guy. There's too many of us. Like, what am I even seeing? Bro, mind, we have a whole nother DD south as well. Like, look at all these guys. All these guys are hopping south. And then we're the ones hopping north. So we just sandwich people. Let's keep it going. We're running in. I see a tentacle whip. He is not getting dark bow spec because he is not worth it. I see another tentacle whip. On a normal whip. He's dead. Beautiful. And then once again, we use the altar. And we go back to the DD spot. And this should be pretty self-sufficient now, you know? Have you checked the Woody Agility course yet? Have not checked the Woody Agility course yet, but we will. For now, I just want to get, basically, man, my goal here is there is probably a good few people in this DD that has never PK'd before in their life, you know? And I just want to get them to just have a little bit like, oh, you know, I killed someone. So that's, that's kind of the plan. That's kind of the plan at the moment. That's me. You see, Oss is saying I've never PK'd before, you know? That is, uh, that is what you want to see. Plus Team 16 Cape. Did he just log in to try and barrage clump us? I didn't even notice that. You guys killed him before I even looked at the screen. So, well done, boys. Well done. And yeah, we'll do some more little uh, altered sweeping in and out, whatnot. And then when we get bored, we'll look for some maybe multi-clans to fight if they're down. And then someone's gone out of Castro. Um, and then from there, I will then probably go up to the Willy Agility course, which will be solo, sadly. But, you know, this is this is our little team bonding activity. You know, that is all we care about. Who are you? Steve has logged in in the wrong world. Poor Steve Mobile. That guy just logged in, man, looking to do like a little bit of PK. And there's like 50 people here. Poor Steve. Difa, appreciate you, man. Try, I'll, I'm going to try and pump out like a little YouTube video of this. Wait, there's someone. Are they logging in to try and snipe us? Wait, chat, there's a team. Kill the team. We can hella win this. The guys who logged in south, kill the team. We are in 443 north. Here, oh, they're dying. They are so dying. Chat, just get out the clump. It's Rot, okay? Rot are literally the most overrated multi-team in the world. Trust me, bang them out. If you've got Barrage, see you later, Mr. RJ Crylord. You're in the bin, buddy. 
all right? Ballistas, you want to focus the mysticas, okay? So they have to put hides on so they can't do much. They're hashtagging rot while being in a five-man clump. If I was them, I'd hashtag another team because this is embarrassing, man, all right? We're winning, boys. Fuck rot, all right? Kick their heads in. All I'm gonna say, man, is look at the minimap. They can't fake an ending when it's live on stream. Rot your dog shit. Sorry, okay, I'm back. Um, bro, we're just winning. Like, I can just run around. I can literally just run around. What are we, you're dead. You're rot member, you're dead, aren't you, buddy? There's a rot member with a rune crossbow in the middle. Bro, I can feel the old multi rev cave dino coming back. It's, it's not good. It's not good at all. I need, to, I need to behave myself, you know? I have forgotten anti-venom, which isn't amazing. Um, they're tabbing. Are they all leaving? I believe they've joined the friends chat. Can we get a rank if possible trying to get names and kicking them from the friends chat? This is why we had the team capes, you know? So the next thing they'll do is they'll try and put a team cape on. Again, all multi-teams are dog ass, as, I, as I've always said. They'll always just try and fight you with like a weird advantage. Bam, he's dead. Um, are they all dead? I'm very confused as to what's going on here, man. This is one of them times. If I tell you up, am I going to get absolutely clapped? I'm worried. Good luck. Am I alive? I'm kind of alive. No, no, I'm definitely not kind of alive. Bro, the whole of Rot are in the friends chat. <laughs> I think we'll leave this world chat. All right, I think we'll leave. They're all in the friends chat. Like, you know, I can't really do anything about that. I've been called a scrawny dweeb and an ugly fuck. That's upsetting. Well, multi team has ruined multi themselves, man. I would be so down to clear them if they gave a normal fight. But if they join our friends chat, I can't be asked trying to like work out who's who. You know, like they know they're inferior. We move. Hey, Donna, how are you enjoying the new update? I mean, it's a nice little multi random fun thing. Off tuna, off tuna, off tuna, off tuna. I mean, they're not in the friends chat, all right? Like, I just... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Was, was that just... Oh, it was in 5.13 as well. Oh, no. He lost AGS. I'll refund his AGS if whoever got it doesn't give him the AGS back. Which means we're... Oh, we're winning! Go, boys! Okay, we got this. Kick the heads in. Fuck it. We've got... Yeah, kill them. Kill them all. I see, uh, I see so many brews on the floor. Give me the brews. Again, if you are taking single targets, you want to focus on anyone in Mystics. Because one, they're going to have low defense, and two, they're going to be the dickheads that clump you. Um, there's no point doing individual calls here. Simply attack people that don't look like they're with us. They won't be in the friends chat. The only thing we can really go on is the friends chat because everyone else will be trying to pretend they're with us because we are cool. It's that simple, you know? And I honestly believe we are winning this. I'm going to show the map because I know people like to see the map in multi-fights. I think we can wipe these anyway. I'm looking at Hick at the telly spot. He looks very alone right now. He's running up north. They're doing their little P-neck tanking. I'm pretty much just, ooh, there's a lot of scary people up north. I think they just try and get like a few people to karate spec my forehead because I will inevitably perish. Oh shit, I've been frozen. Things are not looking good here for myself, but maybe for other people. Who knows? If I flick the fang and then camp pray thingy, I'm alive. You're all shit. Okay, yeah, they are all just looking for me. So if I just run them into you guys, you guys just kill whoever the fuck you want, you know? Okay, I think I'm getting camped by Mr. Hick. Hello, Mr. Hick. If I freeze Mr. Hick and then stand here, and then we do a little dance. Oh, I can't do a dance. Wait, there's a lot of people on me here. I should probably move. Moving would probably be a smart idea. Am I dead? I'm alive? Bro, I'm so good at this game. Like, you don't even understand. I have no supplies and I'm, I got two minutes left on my TB. I think it's time for us to start running away. I don't know about you guys. Look at him. Oh, he's teleported. Well, you guys stay in the fight. Fuck it. Oh, Sven. What the fuck is Sven? 
Sven! Wait, I need restores. Oh, Sven, you're a beautiful man. Let's get back to it, boys. I'm going back up there with zero tank ability, but sure. I love multi-wars until you wipe the team and then it's just whoever has the least life returns 50 times. Rot Dino. Oh, I'm so dead, aren't I? They're in the friends chat again, man. I've never seen a multi team. Oh my, I'm so good at this game. I've just tanked like 50 Karasi specs. I'm still alive. Rot your dog shit. However, I am now out of all combo food and out of Pnex, so I am probably going to die here, in which case I will say good fight. I mean, I tanked pretty well. I think I tanked pretty well there, man. I'll take that. My stance on multi-teams, you know my stance on multi-teams, man. They're all dog shit, and I stand by that stance. Um, but I just don't want you guys getting farmed and dying, you know? So if you guys find your way out of there, all right, we absolutely smoked the floor of them for like the first three times they returned. But obviously, they're going to keep coming back. Um, we have a man here doing some agility and some anti pk by the looks of things. Sadly for him, though, he's about to perish. Oh, if you go over that, you're going to get stacked out. You're just, you're just dead. Like, you're so dead. Because all the hits are going to hit you at the same time. You, you didn't, you, I didn't, you're just dead. 133k. Okay, not amazing loot here. I feel like people need to do more agility laps. You know? I don't think I got any good loot keys there, did I? Oh, 1.1 mil. Tell a lie. So this is the sort of loot you get from Woody Agility. Uh, six rune chains, five rune kites, 219 blighted matter rays, 220. Seems like there's a lot of blighted supplies coming in. Um, some Alka Balls. This guy is also going multi. I can't attack him. Oh, he hella just got baited. Bro, the multi boy's done it. That's why I didn't want to say anything. Because I knew Squee was with us. And there, there are boys that just got the kill, for example. That right there. Beautiful, boys. Beautiful. I didn't want to say anything, man. Because otherwise I'd end up thingy in it. I don't know. I did that and did not get loot. Yeah, so you want to go in, man. You want to pay 150k to the pillar thing. And then if you leave or log out, it will reset and you'll lose your 150k. But if you stay in there, every lap you get, you get loot increasing in value the more laps you do. Which I'm hoping makes sense. Destined to be dead content within a year. I genuinely think, man, this sort of thing will only get better content the quieter it gets. Because you'll then find people doing agility here who are doing about 50 laps, having loads of GP on them, and it then makes it worthwhile PKing them again. 